Hi folks, Robert Stevens here, and on this video we're going to be talking about the Godox AKR22 Collapsible Diffusion Dome. This is a light modifier for select uh, roundhead flashes in the Godox lineup. Um, it is compatible with the AD100, AD200 with the round flash attachment and the Godox V1. And um, this is almost certainly a um, competitor to the MagMod MagSphere, which has uh, a big following of users, honestly. And so if you are looking for uh, a dome diffusion style modifier for your roundhead flash, um, I actually would urge you to check this one out. Uh, the price on it is only $26.90 on most of the online retailers. And um, it foregoes the magnet attachment uh, that a MagSphere uh, uses in that MagSphere, you know, MagMod system, and instead just has a sleeve style attachment that attaches fairly easily. Um, and uh, I mean, not quite as easily as the MagSphere, but easily enough. Holds very, very firmly, um, and it uh, has a, a feature that MagSphere does not, and that is it does not just have this round dome style. You can fold it up and down into different shapes, and that's a benefit because the dome style just sends light everywhere, um, and honestly, that is not my preference. I like directionality in my light. And you can do this pop and it gives you a much more directional, um, you know, light to use. Uh, it goes down another step further. Now this step is a bit fiddly. Uh, I have found that it is actually easiest to fold it down like this first. Um, and then pop the top down um, and you get an even more directional version. Um, I sort of think that I like this version as a bit of a happy medium and uh, how I have been using this uh, in the testing phase of it um, has been for my real estate interior work. Uh, it works really well for that actually. Um, I shoot flambient style real estate where you merge a, a flash exposure with an ambient exposure and a, a, a darker window pull exposure um, for a really high polished, um, you know, image. And um, this just seems to work very well, actually. And uh, I have tried it in the, uh, it actually works pretty well in the dome uh, variant for that. If I were shooting people with it, um, like for wedding work, which I do intend to do, I would be using this version, honestly, because I want that directionality of the light. But the dome diversion, uh, diffusion version works well because it sends the light kind of everywhere evenly. I'm still bouncing it off the ceiling, but it sends some around the room too, uh, and the diffusion itself helps take off some of the edge of the shadows. Um, I definitely have to uh, say that um, in that comparison, you know, 26 bucks versus uh, the 110 for the MagMod kit that contains the MagSphere, it is a better value proposition. Um, I, if I was telling someone looking for a diffusion dome, I do believe this is the one that I would recommend. Uh, there are other alternatives even in the market, the Gary Fong dome, all this other stuff, but uh, this one is cheap, it is simple, and therefore if you have a round head flash, it's probably your best option. Um, I um, Obviously, you're kind of out of luck if you have a regular style speed light head or you don't have the round head for this, but uh, if you do, definitely worth a look into. Um, I will be using it for my wedding work uh, this, this year and um, will continue to use it for my interior real estate work. Thank you, and uh, take it easy, guys.